All right, it's a new line up called uh, Arden City, and it's highlighting the creativity of downtown Dayton. Joining me now, Emily Broughton, the special events manager for the Downtown Dayton Partnership, and Ashley Simons, owner of Barstools and Brushstrokes, uh, who is painting uh, the party host. You're going to be the painting party host down there. That is correct. So good to have both of you ladies on. A lot of fun happening this Friday, and I have to say, Brian's got an excellent forecast for Friday coming along. But Thanks. kick, I know, right? <laughs> Fingers crossed. But kick this off for us, Emily. Art in the City, what's it about? Art in the City, it's really a great way to feature visual arts in downtown Dayton. Uh, we'll have painting parties, we'll have art around town, we're featuring local artists in all kinds of different businesses, whether it be retail, um, restaurants, we have um, art opening galleries at DVAC, we have K-12 is having a street art throwdown, they're having all kinds of cool innovative artists like uh, spray paint artists and they have things inside. We're really excited about painting the town with um, our friend here Ashley. I'll let her tell you a little bit about her parties. Yeah, so Ashley, I, I heard that you're going to be downtown. Now, I tried my hand earlier on Living Day to actually paint one of those things. They're tougher than you think, but you're going to be able to do that. That's right? correct. That's correct. So we actually have two paintings that um, you will have the option of uh, creating, mm -hmm. and we are really doing a walk-by. It's not set on the top of the hour. Just as you're walking by, if you decide to paint with us, we have these set up, and then we have them broken down. It's really step-by-step. -step. We have about 10 canvas set up that shows you exactly what you're going to draw, what color you're going to paint it, mm -hmm. and then you move on to the second step, but we'll be there to guide you. But honestly, we've made it so simple, it really should be like painting by numbers. And so it's a good opportunity for folks that may have never even done this before. They're walking by, they see this opportunity, and you make it easy for them. Without a doubt, without a doubt. And then we will also be um, down by Lily's Bistro creating energy enhancing bracelets. So what we'll be doing is um, making these single strand bracelets. You come with an intention in mind. Are you looking for love? Are you looking to bring money into your life? And based on that All intention. The above, do you have one for that? Go. Yeah, yeah. You can mix and match our gemstones and then we'll create a bracelet for you that you wear it's kind of um you know an inspiration if you will as you wear it you think about the positive energy that you're trying to bring into your life and those gemstones yeah. will um help bring that to you really comes down to all the art and of course there's a lot of it happening mm -hmm. in Dayton why do you think it's so important just to celebrate art right here in the Miami Valley I think people aren't always aware that we have so many great um artists and art companies and and so many people willing to create art outside and publicly that I think mm -hmm. it's a great way to really draw attention to that downtown mm -hmm. um we have all kinds of different art groups um and then just different people who are featuring events on town sideshows going on at the old yellow cab building and they'll have all kinds of artists there too musical um, and visual and then there's also picking in the park at riverscape which is put on by five river metro parks mm -hmm. and they'll also have things like poetry slams and live music as well what i want to point out too a lot of folks may get thrown off of oh, these are a lot of events happening all at the same time i don't even know what to do but you have a map for them we do we are very handy this map right here is on our website you can get it, an electronic version of it at downtowndayton.org mm -hmm. um, and so on the front side we have some features and on the back side we have a detailed map of downtown um, so you can really plot out wherever you want to go and whatever you want to experience some things are more um, active and some are just more passive some things you can look and the great thing is it's all free it's all free all free I love how you end with that point here are the details art in the city come be a part of it guys the weather's gonna be beautiful there's so much for you to do it's fantastic uh, Friday May 8th starts at 5 p.m. again that map that we're showing you you can find it at downtowndayton.org